Zen has been summed up in four statements. A direct transmission outside scriptures and apart from tradition. No dependence on words and letters. Direct pointing to the human mind and seeing into one's own nature and becoming Buddha. What's up, y'all? I'm with Alejandro and Kent and Kai. Today we're tackling two of the Adirondacks peaks, Cascade and Porter. There's like 42 total, I believe, but we'll start with two. Stay tuned. So we finally made it to the park. Uh, Finally, after this guy fucking got us lost. This is like my first real hike. How you feel? Fucking ready. So Alejandro here is my buddy from the army. And what's your name again? Kent is somebody I met for a week, about two weeks ago in Texas. And now we are on a hike together in the Adirondack Mountains. It really does deal with a domain of experience that can't be talked about. Oh, Kai's found water. <laughs> he's been booking up the mountain like he, he's been here before. Dog version of Jennifer Lawrence has come up here. Every artist feels when he gets to the end of his work Where's the top? something absolutely essential that was left out. I swear to God, we've so climbed this mountain four times. <laughs> As a finger pointing at the moon. Get up the fucking jungle. I'm ready to get fucking drunk. So, this trail is supposed to be like two ish miles. We just asked somebody again how far we were from the top. And they keep telling us different distances. And this is like we're never gonna reach the top. If I don't get a drink, I'm gonna die. <laughs> so, this numpty's just handed me the camera and told me a vlog. So, here we go. Uh, we're collecting uh so we're gonna be using this shit as a uh, toilet paper we're in the army and this is what we're taught to do so yeah it's not poison ivy for sure shit. i hope <laughs> look at that turn around that's definitely a long way down so i, I can't vlog and drink apparently <laughs> which is that's not fair if you ask me here's something colder up here so we know we're close 100 percent <laughs> <Fucking wet. laughs> Tragic. Think I do, think I do for you, Kai. No dog left behind. <laughs> so we're not at the top still. But look at that view. Go, 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 go. That is amazing. That turn around. Whoa. Holy shit. Uh, unfortunately, ideas like the ultimate ground of being, the self. Brahman, ultimate reality, the great void, all that is very, very abstract talk. And Zen is concerned with a much more direct way of coming to an understanding of that, or thatness as it's called, tathata in Sanskrit. I think first of all, the appeal of Zen lies in its unusual quality of humor. Religions aren't as a rule humorous in any way. Views are amazing. The serious. The drinks are even better. And when one looks at Zen art and reads Zen stories, it is quite apparent that something is going on here which isn't serious in the ordinary sense, however sincere it may be. There's no way. That two was 2.2 miles. Point two miles. It's two miles, I guess, if you go the long fucking Yeah, road. okay. Bro, there's no way we did two miles. That's way more. Easy as fucking shit, no lad. <laughs> Look at his ankles. <laughs> no, I was fucking chilling at home, and this fucking gringo took me all the way up there. <laughs> it was good. It's a nice hike. I recommend it to anybody. I love it. Yo, cheers to a great day and more to 
Wake up.